In the early days of Hollywood, there were some issues because many of the people who came to write came from New York, and they were very fancy. They thought they were better writers than that silly screenplay stuff. So when they came to Hollywood, they didn't really take their work seriously. They didn't ask for too much credit. Uh, Edna Ferber, I want to talk about for a minute. She was a novelist from New York. Uh, the quote I just think is cute. She said, a woman can look both moral and exciting if she also looks as if it was quite a struggle. So she wrote a lot about early attitudes toward fe females and sex. She also wrote Showboat, which is a classic film in the United States. And she wrote Giant, which is one of James Dean's, his last film. And she wrote this film, Saratoga Trunk, all based on novels she had written first. She was smart enough when she came to Hollywood to require the studio to lease her novels, not to buy the rights, so that they had to credit her. And after a few years, they couldn't show the film anymore because it always remained in her possession. And that was a brilliant idea. But too many other of the New York writers didn't take their work as seriously and didn't bother with that idea. So it went away. And we lost that chance to own our work. 